We're actually using Brian for other things now too. So we don't just use the consulting um, offsite retreats and strategy. Uh, when we have certain challenges, we've brought Brian in to work with a specific uh, VP in that department to start figuring out some, we had some team uh, um, structure issues. How do we set up this team? How should they work together? And Brian helped us through that. So yeah, he has communication with the rest of the team. And I think that's another interesting point about having this kind of outside consultant come in you tend to get a lot of eye rolling. You know, the VPs go, yeah, great, another consultant, just what we need, you know. And, um, and what, what's been great about Brian's approach is um, he's, he's sort of won their trust um, over time by, again, listening and asking the right questions and then offering up the right kind of help as opposed to just the pat answers that a lot of, a lot of textbooks and, and, again, consultants can give you. So um, the rapport has been great. And, um, and the guys get pushback too. I mean, that's the other thing I'll say is, Brian's not afraid to question your thought processes. He's not afraid to push you a little bit and go, uh, you know, I'm not, not gonna let you off the hook that easily. You gotta think about this. And um, once you've gained someone's trust, you can get away with that and it actually works. And that's what Brian's been able to do, so.